walk it off. What's up everybody? Welcome to your on-demand workout for today. If you haven't yet, please smash that subscribe button so you can continue to get more awesome workouts like this one you're about to get yourself into. We're going to start this bad boy off. We have one minute of cardio of your choice and then one minute running clock. That running clock is going to consist of body weight lunges. Feel free to go any direction you want to. Alright, if you're not lunging today, feel free to just do air squats. From there, we're going to a two-hand dead high pull. You'll grab your bell, have that available to you as soon as you finish that cardio. From here, place that bell in between your feet, snap your hips, pull that bell towards your chin. Long inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up, and let the bell float. No need to rush through it. Feel free to take your time. Count maybe one or two Mississippis at the bottom before you get into your next rep. From there, we're gonna go into a lateral um, high knee or a three-step hurdle, as I like to call it. From here, uh, one, two, three, lateral steps. Just keeping those knees nice and high. Try to get that cardiovascular aspect within that one minute. And then finally, we're gonna hit the floor. We have one minute of mountain climbers. Nice tall plank position, knees up towards your elbows. All right? And then we'll get into it. But anyway, let's get this thing going. One minute on the clock. Cardio of your choice. Let's have some fun today, all right? We're gonna burn it up. Burn, baby, burn. Three, two, one, let's go. Just get that blood flowing, that heart going. You got it. 30 more seconds. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Stop what you're doing. Let's get into lunges. Like I said, feel free to change up the directions if you want to. I'm going reverse. This might just my go-to. But you guys can go forward. You can go sideways. It's your workout. Oh, those legs are gonna burn. Just take your time here with those lunges. Just try to get that knee down as low as you can. And remember, if you're not lunging today, just feel free to squat, all right? You will see lunges in today's workout, so do squats if you're not lunging, all right? You'll be good to go, I promise. All right, we're gonna hit that dead high pull up, so grab your bell in three, Two, one, doesn't have to be heavy. From here, zip it up, back down. Bend the knees, drive with the hips. guys hang in there you can take a rest here one two drive one two drive fifteen seconds Three, two, one, mountain climbers, let's go. Let's get those knees up towards your elbows. Come 
Come on, stick with it. You got it. Twenty-five more seconds. Finish it off. Three, two, one, three step hurdle. Come on. This is a lateral shuffle, side to side. Let's get those knees up, okay? So much harder, so much more challenging than Okay, so get the knees up, move with purpose. Oh, the booty. Three, two, one, and rest. Nice work. Hopefully you're feeling nice and warm right now, because I am. All right, let's talk about today's workout. This is how it's gonna flow all day long. We have 15 seconds of work, 15 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest, so essentially, 30 seconds of activity, 15 seconds of rest. Those 30 seconds will be broken up into two, two different movements or left and right sides, okay? I have three different bells with me today. I have a heavy, a medium, and my standard, okay? I guess I could say moderate, heavy, heavy light, maybe. I'm gonna start it off with that heavy bell. We have deadlifts, okay? I don't expect you guys to go super heavy, okay? Because it's 15 seconds of work. I'd rather get like five, five to 10 reps somewhere in that range in within that 15 seconds. And then we're going right into the jump squats. So this is what it looks like. You stand above that bell, chest is tall and proud. Hips go back, grab that handle. Stand up tall, squeeze those glutes. Long inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up. And you really want to get nice quality reps in within that 15 seconds. From there, we're going right into jump squats. So you just place that bell on the floor, squat down, and then leave the earth for 15 seconds. If you're not jumping today, feel free to pulse for 15 seconds. We're gonna go back and forth between the two movements with 15 seconds of rest in between for six total rounds. Okay, so static efforts here. You ready to rock and roll? Fantastic. Deadlifts, jump squats, coming up in 10. Booty burner right here. No ifs or buts about it. Come on, let's go. All right, belt down. Jump. Come on, ten seconds. Three, two, and one. Shake it out. 15 seconds here. Told you, it's burning already. Now it's the first set. Ready, get back on that bell. Three, two, one, deadlift. Bell down, jump. Come on, right into it. And rest. Ooh, baby.
on round number three. Let's get over that hump. In two, one, deadlift. Bell down, jump. Three, two, rest. We're over it as we're building it. You ready? Number four, in three, two, one, let's rock. All right, bow down, jump into it. Three, two, and rest. Ah, two more to go. Quick little burner here, just quick one. Three, two, one. Pump it up. Bells down. Jump. Come on, guys. Three, two, rest. Last one. Let's have at it. In two, one, finish it. Jump, come on. Fire it up. Three, two, and rest. Oh my goodness. Booty burn. Guys, rest, recover. Coming up next, we're keeping it simple. I am grabbing that medium heavy bell, that moderate bell. We're going single arm swings. Left, right into right hand side, and then we're resting. Six rounds, just like last time. You're gonna grab that bell. I'm, only, I'm going heavier, just because it's only 15 seconds of uh, work. You know what I mean? So, you should be able to handle a heavier load. Grab that bell, like it high in the groin, snap those hips, stand up tall. Make sure that bell floats. I like to keep that bell just in line with my chest, arm nice and straight, 15 seconds. Switch midair, 15 seconds on the right. Go back and forth. You ready to go? Six times through. Keep it as simple for you guys. 10 seconds. About 10 side to start. In three, two, one, swing. Keep that belt high in the groin. It's a heavier load, follow it through with the hips. Switch sides. Three, two, and rest. Guys, when you're doing single arm stuff, a lot of people tend to bend with that uh, loaded side. Focus on bending the knees at the same time, not just relying on one side. You're losing a lot of power. Come on, let's swing. Let's 
Let's switch. And rest. Breathe. Two down. Four to go. Let's get over that hump. Three, two, one, let's roll. Switch sides. And rest. Is that booty on fire yet? I know that thumper's going. The sweat's about to pour. Three, two, one, have at it. Switch. And rest. Two to go. Touch that booty. Yeah, it's warm to the touch, right? Ready? Let's do it. Switch sides. And rest. One more. Let's finish it. Here we go. Two. One, rocket. Switch sides. Three. Two and rest. Woo Breathe. Catch your breath. Yeah. Oh my goodness. All right, guys. Coming up next. Two of my all-time favorites. Ballistic rows, bicep curls. Let's pump up those arms. We're staying above that bell, that ballistic row. Think about having a triangle underneath you and the sternum is the top. So we're gonna go from the left, pull center of the body, transition at the top, slowly lower down to the opposite side of the body, to the right. Okay, so you're almost forming this triangle or upside down V. So, Hips are back, chest and tall and proud. Grab that bell, pull it up to the center line, then lower it down to the other side. Shift left and right, but keep your back flat and neutral. Try to uh, eliminate as much as possible. Refrain from teeter-tottering side to side too much, okay? Tag team, again, with bicep curls. Pull that bell right up, hold the horns of the bell from here, come all the way down, and squeeze on the way up. Long inhale down, exhale on that squeeze. Six times. Let's have at it. A 
Ballistic rows in three, two, one, let's go. One, all the weights on the glutes, not your low back. Three, two, zip it up. Let's curl. And rest. Good job, guys. Let that arm, that blood flow through those arms. Gnarly pump coming up. You ready? Two, one, let's row. Three, two, zip it up, let's curl. Two, one, bells down. Breathe. <sighs> Ooh wee. Burner for real. Back to those rows. In two, one, let's do it. Come on. Three, two, zip it up. Bicep curls. Two, one, shake out those arms. We're halfway through. Back to those rows. Set, let's go. Zip it up, let's go. Three, two, and rest. You guys feel it? The pump is for real. Two more rounds. Let's get back on it. Come on, let's rub. Three, two, pull it up, curl. And rest, shake it out, we got one more round. Biceps are screaming, how about you? They are, aren't they? Let's finish it up strong. In two, one. Pull it up, finish it off strong. Three. Two and one, shake out those arms. Oh my goodness. All right guys, recover a little bit, drink some water. Next up, we have lunges. All right, we're gonna hold that bell in the goblet position, nice and tight. We're gonna lunge with one leg for 15 seconds, then lunge with the next. So you can go backwards, all one leg for 15. You can go sideways if you want. You can also go forward if you want, all right? And we'll simply just switch those legs halfway through. If you're not lunging today, feel free to squat, all right? 
in that goblet, goblet squat for 30 seconds. Keep it simple, okay? You ready to rock and roll? I'm gonna go reverse, forward, lateral, and then reverse it. Lateral, forward, reverse. Okay, since we're here for six rounds. Follow my lead or do your own thing. Come on, bells up. Step back, all on one side. Take your time, there's no rush. All right, just try to get that knee down as low as you can. Let's switch sides, go ahead. Three, two, one, bells down, shake it out. I'm going forward lunge. You guys do you. Bells up. Let's go. Three, two, one, and switch. Well, hang in there. Three, two, one, and rest. I'm going lateral this time. Bells up. Let's go. Take your time here. A little bit different than a forward or back. All right, let's switch. Five seconds. One more. And rest. Nice work. All right, now I'm gonna reverse it back. I'm gonna return to his laterals, then go forward, and then go backwards. Come on, bells up. Let's do it. Three, two, other side. One, one more. And rest. Going forward. Come on, let's do it. Get that bell up. Lunge. Three, two, one, and switch. One more. And rest. Shake out those arms. I know the shoulders are burning. I feel it. Last one. I'm going backwards. Let's go. Three, two, switch legs. Come on. Three, two, one, and rest. Burner. Nice work. Drink some water, short little rest. All right, coming up. 
Let's ease up the lower body. Let's go with the lunges. What do you guys think? I mean, not lunges. Push presses. We just did lunges. Holy moly. All right, push press. Little dip and drive. Don't get confused. No, it's not a thruster. There's no full squat. Just a little dip from the knees. Assistance to get that bell up overhead. All right? So from here, rack it up. A little dip, drive, dip, drive. Good rapid pace here. Again, left, right sides. 15, 15, then we rest. Let's get into it. Bells up. Let's go. Dip, drive, count your reps. Switch sides. That's it. All right, guys, hopefully you counted your reps. Therefore, you kind of maintain that cadence throughout. I was hitting seven. I'm gonna try to hit that number every round from here on out. You guys do the same. Get it up. Let's go. Switch sides. And rest. And all the good thing about knowing your numbers is that you automatically know when to switch. So if you miss that buzzer, you already know to switch. Here we go. Rack it up. Dip and drive. Other side. And rest. Ooh, burner. We're almost there. Here we go. Two, one, get it. Switch. And rest. Woo. Two more to go. Come on, clean it up. Let's do it. Switch sides. Ha. Oh, it's getting tough. One more set. Thank goodness. Let's finish this puppy up. In two. One, go. Switch. Uh, 
Ah, that's a bell. Woo! Oh, those shoulders are toasty. Breathe. We have one more combo. Last one for the day. Push-ups and burpees. Oh my goodness, yes, I did just say that. We're gonna hit the floor, guys. Push-ups right into the burpee. No second guessing what we're doing. You just said, I just said it four or five times already. Here, go all the way down, all the way up. Feel free to drop to those knees if necessary for those push-ups. When I say let's go, jump in and jump right up and get to those burpees, okay? Let's get it. This, goes, this one right here, probably the most challenging one of the day, I promise. Three, two, one, let's go. Two, one, and burpee. Come on, get it in. Three, two, one, rest. Whew. Come on, five to go. Come on, on the floor. Push ups. In two, one, go. It burns. Burpee, come on. Five seconds. One more burpee. Get it. And rest. Four to go. The shoulders are screaming. The thumper is going. Come on, let's push. Go. Ah. And burpee. Come on. You guys got it. Three, two, stop. We're halfway through. It wasn't too bad for the first three rounds. Let's finish it off. Come on, you haven't died yet. Ready? Push. Ah. Three, two, one, go. Come on, baby, push. One more. And rest. Breathe through. Three, two, one. Push up. Come on. Ah, it burns so good. Three. Two, burpee, let's roll. One more here. And rest. This is it. Final round. Danger zone, right now. Red line. In two, one, push-ups. Mm. 
Ah, I'm broken. Burpee, finish it. Three, two, one, and rest. Walk it off. You guys all right? We're not finished. I need you guys three minutes, okay? Grab yourself a mat. Just a quick little ab burner. Two exercises, 15 second running clock. The only difference between this and the rest of our workout was, there's no rest. Okay, so we're going leg raises right into what I call a penguin. Follow me down. We're gonna start, lie on our backs. Have your hands underneath your butt cheeks. From here, get your shoulders off the ground, look down at your feet, and then kick your heels to the sky. Inhale down, exhale on that kick. From there, drop your feet right here. Shoulders remain up and waddle or rock side to side and reach for those ankles. You're moving from the upper body, not from the arm, okay? Let's get into it. We have 10 seconds. Leg raises are up first. In three, two, one, let's go. Inhale down, exhale on that kick. Penguins in three, two, drop, rock. FYI, I call these penguins because it looks like a penguin waddles side to side. Oh, it burns. Get those riblets going. Two, one, leg raises. Come on, kick up. Inhale down, exhale, that kick. If you want to challenge this movement, separate your feet, don't let them touch. Two, one, penguin. Well, really rock. Squeeze the obliques. Let's get back into it. Leg raises. Come on, guys, I know it burns. I'm right there with you. Three, two, ah! Penguins, come on. Think about pulling your rib cage all the way down to your pelvis. Two, one. Oh, they're seizing up. Two, one. <laughs> Penguin. Come on, we're almost there. Leg raises. If you want to challenge this a bit more, bring your hands from out, from under your butt. Put them on the side. Three, two, penguins, let's go. Ah, last one. Let's finish it up. Come on, lift and kick. Three, two, 15 seconds. Come on. Ah, three, two, one, and rest. I'll just lay there. Swing those legs side to side. 
Oh my goodness, loosen it up. I guess you'll. Ah, I get it. Whew. All right, guys, let's just sit up right here. Let's reach for those toes. Stretch out the back of those legs. Nice workout, you guys, today. Way to push, push through. Burpees and push-ups, definitely the hardest ones, no doubt about it, today. All right, let's roll over. Let's come to that cobra position. Hands underneath the shoulders. From here, push yourself up with the cobra. Rotate side to side, look down at your ankles. From there, tuck your toes, get those hips up in a downward dog. Pedal out those legs. Lock those knees, slowly walk your hands towards your toes. Hang on that toe touch position. Shift your hips left to right. Bend your knees, roll up out of it. Get your arms up overhead. Whew. Tilt side to side. Drop those arms, shake it loose. Fantastic job out of you guys today. Way to crush it, way to push through. That's all I have for you today. I want to thank you for coming. I hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't yet, please smash that subscribe button so you can continue to get awesome workouts like this one you just wrapped up. Comment below. Which, um, which interval, which superset was the worst one for you? Let me know. Until then.